We actually bumped into the U.S. Coast Guard here at Branson Duck Tours today for a regular inspection as we got a first-hand look at the brand new boats and business here in Branson. The National Transportation Safety Board's final investigation in 2020 reveals the probable cause of the sinking. Ride the Ducks Branson's continued operation of waterborne tours after a severe thunderstorm warning was issued for Table Rock Lake, recommending removal of side curtains and canopies that trap passengers on the World War II era vehicles. The Coast Guard later agreeing with those suggestions. Branson Duck Tours owner Richard Corby tells us captains have constant communication with the National Weather Service, a big change, and follow strict weather protocol. Their new boat design does not have side curtains. Corby adds that the suggestion to remove the controversial canopies does not apply to modern amphibious automobiles in operation here. The roof is really important because it's been over 100 degrees here for the last three weeks. And heat stroke is a real possibility in those temperatures. So it's very, very important not just to consider one thing that could happen, but to consider any emergency that could be a potential problem for our customers. Three people involved in that tragic accident of 2018 still face prosecution today. The captain and GM of Ride the Ducks Branson each charged with 17 counts of involuntary manslaughter for the 17 people who died four years ago today. A preliminary hearing is set for November 8th. Reporting live in Branson, Lauren Barnes, Ozarks First.